Once upon a time, in a riverside, there lived a clever monkey in an apple tree. He was very happy because he had all the sweet apple to eat. Yay, hey, I love this place. I have all the apple for myself. One day, a lost and hungry crocodile came by the apple tree. Who are you? Monkey, please help me. I'm lost and hungry. Poor you. Here, have some apple and I will show you the way home. The monkey gave the crocodile is some sweet apple. Mmm, these apples are very sweet. Thank you. I can give you more if you pass by again, my friend. Several days later. Time goes by, the monkey and crocodile became good friends. They chat and play the all day. Things. Take ice cream. We like different flavors. And we don't always see things the same. Once you called me a name, and I returned the favor. But you are my best friend forever. The monkey gave the crocodile some sweet apple as well to take home for his wife. Here, take this apple for your wife. Thank you, friend. Taste this apple, my wife. These are given by my friend monkey. The crocodile gave the apple to her wife, but the wife has other evil things. Hmm, these apples are very sweet indeed. If the monkey eats it every day, he must have a sweeter heart. I want to eat his heart. But, but, here's my friend. If you don't give me his heart, I will not eat and be very angry at you. Now go. Go get me his heart. Scared of his wife, the crocodile planned how to kill the monkey and went back to the apple tree. Hello again, my friend. My wife loves the apple so much. She, she wants to invite you for a dinner. That's very nice of her. Of course, I will come. The monkey trusted the crocodile so much because they were friends. He was not aware of his true intention. Come on, friend. Hop on my back. I will take you across the river to meet my wife. The monkey hopped on and they started to travel. Let's go on a trip, yippee! I'm so bored doing the same thing I'm doing. Time to go and have
have some fun. Let's get on. On the way, the crocodile felt guilty and told the monkey the truth. Oh dear monkey, I'm very sorry my friend, but the truth is my wife want to eat your heart. The monkey was very shocked and surprised by what he, his friend said, but he quickly think of a way to escape. Oh, okay, sure, why not? Why you didn't tell me that earlier? We monkeys keep our heart safely on the tree. Now we will have to go back to the tree to get my heart. So, take me back. Oh, how silly of me. Okay, let's go back. If we go empty-handed, my wife will eat my heart instead. The crocodile got the monkey back to the tree. The moment they reached the tree, the monkey jumped off the crocodile's back and climbed it. Silly you! Can anyone keep their heart out and stay alive? I help you as friend, but this is what you did in return. You are a traitor. Now you will never get my heart nor the apples. Go away! Since then, the crocodile never come back. He lost both a friend and sweet apples.